G'day everyone, DJ Darks here. Just for a quick tutorial covering machine dimensions. Um, recently I've seen a lot of people asking what the arcade dimensions are, like how high the keys are from the ground, how uh, how far the, the keys are from the screen, and how how far you should be from the screen, and things like that, just so that you get a comfortable distance similar to the arcade. Because uh, what happens for a lot of people, um, you've got a lot of different setups. You know, people sit on the floor, people sit at a table and play, some people play standing up, but I think it's actually kind of important to have that similar distance to the arcade when you're playing, because when you go to the arcade and you settle down for a game, uh, a lot of people say, oh, well, I need to adjust to the cabinet because it's not like what I have at home. And um, creating a setup which is very similar to the arcade, where you can just stand and get into a position that you're naturally comfortable in all the time, really helps, just so, and it's just one less thing that you have to worry about, right, and if you iron out the little things, then, you know, it does make a difference, overall. So I'll get stuck straight into it, as you can see in the pictures I've got, there's three different kinds of monitors, you've got the 40 inch rear projection, projection the 36 inch CRT, and the 37 inch LCD, all of which have different distances, like different viewing distances for the lanes, and stuff like that. Um, so, I'm going to be going off the CRT distance just because that's what I have on the cabinet. I don't have an LCD. But, uh, as you can see, it, it does vary depending on what kind of monitor you have, and I will touch on that at the end. But we'll get stuck straight in. So, what height should you have for your keys? Now, from the base platform to the, uh, to the top of the keys, so not the base of the controller, but to where the keys are resting, I actually took out a tape measure and measured this, you should have that at about 88 centimeters. So, you want to have 88 centimeters from the ground to where your keys are. So, if you've got like a real edition, or if you have a, uh, I don't know, something like that, and a similar thing, like a, a DAO controller, if you have a tape measure, what you want to do is you want to measure from the top where the keys are down to the ground to get that measurement. You don't want to do it from the the bottom of the controller to to the ground, but it should be about 88 centimeters. That's uh, what I measured on my cabinet. Right. So from there, uh, when you get to the top of the keys to the monitor, um, once again, I just measured with a tape measure uh, from the base to the base of the monitor, not not where the monitor starts, but where the screen actually is. So taking it from the the keys, the base of the keys, up to where the screen starts. Okay you want to have that at 30 centimeters. So it's 30 centimeters from the base of the controller to the, the start of the monitor. So you've got, you know, 88 centimeters, then you've got another 30 centimeters. Now for the depth, this is actually a pretty interesting one. Um, I measured from the keys to, to the base of the machine, but this can actually vary quite a bit because as you can see, there's different um, different lengths between the two, uh, the three monitors that we have here. You know, you have a 40 that's like right up in your face, you have a 37 which is right up in your face, and then you have a 37 which is a little bit further back. And um, I actually haven't got an accurate measurement for that, that LCD monitor. Um, judging just from viewing it, it's about, I'd say, 10 centimeters like an extra 10 centimeters for that monitor. So, I mean, you could roughly calculate from there how much viewing distance you want, but I'll give you the base measurement if you've got the screen sort of right up against the machine like the CRT is. Um, that distance is actually 15 centimeters. So it, it actually doesn't seem like that much, um, honestly, like when you look at the controls. So from, from the key panel, so where the, the key sort of ends to, to the effector panel was 15 centimeters. Well, sorry, not not to the key panel, like to the end where the monitor starts is 15 centimeters. But as I said, that's for the CRT monitor, which is a 36 inch, not not the 37 uh, LCD which they're using, which is a bit further back. And I mean, um, it it doesn't really matter, I guess, uh, so long as you've got about I'd say 15 to 30 centimeters clearance between your controller and the screen. Don't have your controller like jammed right up against the screen, you should be okay. Um, for the most part, when I was playing on my monitor here uh, in this room, it wasn't a problem having it just sort of a little bit further back 
And I was playing on a smaller monitor at the time as well, so... I mean, so long as it's about that range, so long as you're not sitting like, I don't know, half a room apart from a TV that's sort of half the size, or, you know, playing on a 50-inch plasma which is like, you know, right up against your face, you should be okay. So long as you're not, like, way, way off from that 15 centimeter mark, as I said, like, it, it seems like it's about 25 to 30 uh, on the LCD. Uh, I can't tell for sure because I can't get an accurate measurement. But, um, yeah, so long as you've got roughly those dimensions, you should be able to play very similar to the stances or the the uh, the, the positions that you're comfortable with uh, at the arcade. So, that's all I really wanted to touch on. This wasn't going to be a long video, but I've kept rambling about different things. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if anyone knows the actual dimension for the LCDs, that would be great. If you can tell me it, I will post it in this video. Make sure that that's there for people to know. But, thank you very much for watching. I, I look forward to hearing if this helped you out or if this uh, affected your setup at all. But yeah, it's great to hear from you guys. Thank you very much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.